What's going on guys, welcome back to a brand new video. Today, I am one position off of number one rank for the fourth consecutive week on Play Now Online. Uh, now, I'm gonna jump across to the PlayStation. You guys can have a quick glance here. As you can see, I am currently second on the weekly leaderboard. Now, three the previous three weeks, I have hit number one. I currently have a record of 285 and 13 with a 95.6 win percentage. And uh, there is one guy that is above me for this week. He has a record of 302 and 61 over overall, not just this week, uh, and his name is Fly King of New York, so obviously maybe an American, uh, but we'll come up against uh, someone randomly on Asian servers, and if we win this game, we will be number one ranked in the world. So guys, let's jump straight into it. I will be using Brooklyn just to ensure that I, I kind of I can win a little bit, uh, but I'm also using that team to work out their jump shots and start to learn them as well, as you guys know from watching my stream. So we'll jump into the video now, jump into the game now, I should say, and uh, let's see if I can win this for the number one rank. Alrighty guys, we are coming up against a guy with the username Byron2030. He's also using the Brooklyn Nets, as pretty much everyone does now online. So we'll jump into this game against Byron using the exact same team. I think he's got the same lineup. Yeah, he hasn't changed anything. So this does have Kyrie Irving on this roster with James Harden, Joe Harris, uh, Kevin Durant, and DeAndre Jordan. So we'll jump into the game and see how well we'll do. Alrighty guys, here we go. We are in the blue here on uh, on this Brooklyn court. We are at home from memory. I think we are at home. Uh, but using the same team, it's going to be quite interesting to see how we go with the slam to start off with Kevin Durant. As you guys know, I run my 2-3 zone. It is uh, it is to basically force people to have to shoot well in this game, which sometimes not a lot of people can. Uh, but if this guy knows how to play, then he should be able to beat it. So I might have to change it up. Uh, we get another stop there, by the way. We might try to get that trail through with Joe Harris. He's not being defended. We'll shoot that with Joe Harris every day of the week, and he does miss. So unfortunately, I do need to start hitting these shots, but that's why I'm using these teams, using these overpowered teams so when it comes time uh, when when Sony starts to run comps or uh, there start to be like competitions around around the world or whatever I can uh, start to know these jump shots like Kyrie I'm starting to get good at Kyrie's jump shot uh, but yeah so that we've got a 5-0 advantage to start off with hopefully this game's nice and close and comes right down to the wire Alrighty, another stop here. We are with James Harden in transition. The moving was at a deep two. It was a deep, no, it was a three-pointer. They gave us three there. The fading three is good with James Harden. And we have an 8-0 advantage. I knew he's going to go to the top then. Still hasn't scored this guy. We get a third stop in a row. Push up with James Harden again. Maybe a little snatch back. Get him crabbed a little bit. There we go. Get that shot off. The mid-range is always good. And a 10-0 advantage in our number one ranked game. So if we win this game, we potentially can be number one ranked in the world for the the fourth week in a row. Alright, this guy has finally scored, so we are only up by seven at the moment. Get the spin inside, get him jumping, and that spin layup. Hall of Fame acrobat there for James Harden. We get it to go a 12 to 3 advantage now so far. We get a little bit of a break here after the stop with uh, James Harden here, and we slam it home for two again. Now 14 to 3 early in this uh, first quarter. I keep getting some stops against this guy. He wants to go to KD, I feel like. He always likes to part. He's shooting these very deep shots, by the way, and that one rims in. He whites it for about 35 feet. Uh, he's going to the menus here. Hopefully, as, a, as you guys know, I hope they don't quit. I hope for a long and uh, he's changed his game plan, which is alright. But I hope for these long games, uh, we get the ball here. We'll, we'll do our five out play. If you guys haven't seen that, there's a video on my channel of how to run a five out with the Hawks 2018 Freelance. Get uh, Actually, we can shoot that. We can shoot that. Get in there. Oh, nearly. But we get the put back there with DeAndre Jordan slamming it inside. 16 to 6. Still keeping up this double digit, uh, double digit advantage. Uh, but we want to make sure that this this guy either quits early or he stays for the long run. All right, we got a steal there with James Harden. KD's back on, on defense here. Try to get a spin inside. Get him to go. It, oh, nearly get the end one. Bit of an awkward situation there. That's a bit of a weird animation. James Harden always makes his free throws, and we make the first and get shot take off of it, and we always green that second one. So we've got a 23-8 to 8 advantage in this first quarter with 45 seconds left. All right, I want to make sure I use this James Harden takeover to our advantage. Maybe try to get some ankles here if we can. Uh, usually, it's only the snatchbacks to really get ankles this year, so we'll try to get one here. Oh, he's, he's playing off ball here, so we can drive inside and slam it all over DeAndre Jordan there. 25 to 10 now, uh, with the last possession of the first quarter right here. 
Durant in the corner this time. He uh, the start of the second quarter here, the big three bomb from, uh, from Kevin Durant, and that puts us up by 18 points in the first minute of this second quarter. All right, here we go. He's running a sort of 2-3. I think he's running maybe it's a 3-2. So no, it's a two, It's a weird zone. This guy's running quite a weird zone. I want Kyrie to come to the top here. He can green that all the all day there for Kyrie Irving. 38-21 to 21 now in this first half. We've got two and a half minutes to go. James Harden's over there in the corner. This guy's flopping. I reckon he may have given up already. He, uh, hopefully, I mean, I wouldn't mind if he quit. It would be a lot quicker getting this number one rank. But we're currently up 19. He shoots a very deep contested shot there. We'll push this tempo, though. Get out with James Harden. Nearly stole the ball there. And slam it home over Joe Harris. Now we have an over 20. Our first 20 point advantage uh, for this game with a minute and a half left. Alright, you guys, coming to the half here, we are up 40, I think it was 46 to 26, a 20 point advantage, and we are absolutely smoking him in stats there. You can see four steals already in the first half. Hopefully, our second half is just as good. Alrighty, here we go. We want to try to take advantage of KD here with uh, with his takeover. I oh, know he's got. Wait, hang on. He's got a, a few switches here. This zone that he's running is quite weird. We get the step inside though and slam it home. We got 21 points now with uh, with Kevin Durant. I know he wants to go corner there. Looks like Joe Harris is out of position. He doesn't make that shot. We're gonna push with KD again though. We got three minutes left in this third quarter. James Harden might be open in the corner. No, he's gonna stay there. He's still open. We'll still green that. And we have a 50. 8 to 31 advantage now. So hopefully this guy sticks around a bit longer. I'd love to finish this game off uh, completely, but if he quits, I, I would kind of understand if he quits. I would quit if I was down this much as well, most likely. Once again, Kevin Durant, though. We've got James Harden from downtown. Very, very deep shot there, and we are now up by 30 points with two and a half minutes remaining. Alright, guys. Eight seconds to go here in this third quarter. We are up by a total of 34. We'll try to get this shot up. Oh, he's keep fouling. This dude's been a bit annoying now. He's just continuously fouling me to get me to the line. Uh, kind of slowing down this game. I think he knows that I was trying to hold for the final shot there. But we get both of the free throws to go. Harden does have takeover. He got it about 30 seconds to go. So we will still have that going into the uh, going into the uh, fourth quarter. However, we've got a 36-point advantage. And uh, I th I'm pretty sure this game's locked in. So hopefully after this, we'll be number one ranked in the world. All right, here we go in our fourth quarter here. Uh, we uh, He scored a little bit more here. But we'll try green that shot with KD. All my players are a bit tired at the moment. So it's a bit of a hassle trying to get them to score. We'll get that steal with James Harden, though. And pull up in transition. Oh, we got him to jump, though. We'll get DeAndre Jordan inside with the slam. DeAndre Jordan himself, 6 points and 19 rebounds. Absolutely dominant performance from him, especially on the boards. Uh, he's trying to drive inside himself with uh, with <laughs> DeAndre Jordan here. He kicks it out to Joe Harris. Maybe he didn't want Joe Harris. And he gets the 3 second violation. So, he's currently, this dude, this dude's, he's kind of struggling a little bit. Um, unfortunately, he, uh, he, I mean, fortunately enough, you know, props to him. He, he stuck around for the entire game as we get another green 3 there with Harden. 84 to 42. We have doubled his score here in the fourth quarter. He wants that drive. Good fail there from Joe Harris. But yeah, we have doubled his uh, doubled his total here. Was that a shooting foul? I reckon they've given him a shooting foul there. Uh, but he, we're up by 40 points here in the fourth quarter of this game. Uh, I think we will hold on, uh, but hopefully we hold on and get this number one ranking for the fourth week in a row. Alrighty, guys. Props to this guy for sticking around. I know I did skip to the end, uh, but he did stay for the entire game. Props to him once again. And a final score of 104 to 57. Unless we make that three ball. Uh, well, that nearly went in. <laughs> but we finished the game 104 to 57. I'm hoping this was enough to get my number one ranking. We'll go into the main menus and have a look as soon as this game is done. Just a quick glance at the box score here. His top scorer was Kevin Durant with 25. And my top scorer was James Harden with 53 and KD. Oh god, th th it was a pretty good, a pretty good showing. I did not score with Joe Harris. I shot 0 of 5 with Joe Harris. 18 of 15 is very, very good with James Harden. I only missed one shot with Kyrie for the whole game, but very, very good performance there from James Harden with a total of 53. We'll jump into the main menus and see if I'm number one. All right, ladies and gentlemen, I am very, very excited to announce that for the fourth consecutive week of NBA 2K21 Next Gen, I have reached number one and I am hoping to stay at number one on the weekly leaderboards. Now, at the end of this month, in the coming month of February, I will be going for the monthly leaderboards as well to try to uh, go undefeated throughout
throughout the entire month of February uh, and while also doing the three or four weeks throughout February as well. So guys, if you want to stick with me throughout Journey, I will pretty much be streaming Play Now every Monday over on my uh, on my Twitch channel and I'll also be doing uh, streams on Wednesday and Friday. So every Monday, Wednesday, Friday at 8.30pm Australian Eastern Daylight Time or Melbourne Time, I'll be streaming on my Twitch. You can also catch me on my Twitter where you can see updates on YouTube videos, on Twitch, on no matter what it is. I appreciate you guys for sticking by and watching this video. It was quite an interesting last game, but I hope you guys did enjoy. Leave a thumbs up if you enjoyed and my favorite comment will be pinned down below. And I'll catch you guys in the next video. Peace.